Hi there, this is Dr. Ann Louise Lockhart with A New Day Pediatric Psychology. Do you find that you are feeling stuck or in a rut um, with some things going on in your life? It's very easy to start thinking that you're bored or you have nothing to do or that you feel useless or that you feel um, like you're lacking a goal, something to focus on. Uh, what I tell people is that instead of treating it as boredom, instead of treating it as you've been derailed, look at it instead as an opportunity, reframe it as an opportunity to rediscover yourself, rediscover your hobbies, rediscover the things that you're good at, and focusing on that instead. So instead of thinking that you have nothing else to do, find a new hobby and just start doing it. Find something that you've always been putting off and doing it instead. Teach your kids to do the same thing as well. So instead of being bored, they're seizing the opportunity. So that's going to be very important for you, for you to model that for your kids and for you to kind of get out of your rut. It's very easy for us, especially as moms, to feel like that's all we're doing. But dads go through the same thing. I don't want us to forget about dads. There are some great dads out there and who are working just as hard to provide for their family, their wives, and their kids. And sometimes as moms and dads, we get so stuck in just being a parent. Now there's joy and blessing and greatness in being a parent, but there's also an important to not lose yourself in just being a parent. We do have an identity in being a parent, but we also have an identity in other things. Being a man, being a woman, being an artist, being a video game designer, being um, an architect, being a business owner, being an athlete, uh, a runner. Um, there's all different things that we identify with, whether it's in our as a parent, as well as in our career or with our hobbies, or even identifying as a wife or a husband or a daughter, a son that our, our identity goes way beyond just being a parent as well. Just as uh, your child's identity goes beyond just being a child in school, that they have other interests and things that they like. So kids who spend all day, all, every day watching videos and playing video games, that's not just their only interest. And it's very hard for kids to not feel bored when that's all they do. So it's really important that you model being something beyond just being a parent, that you model something that's just beyond doing the same thing over and over again, that you go to work and then you pick up the kids and you make dinner and then you like yell at them to go to bed and then you do it all over again. Or if you're staying at home all day with them, that you're at home and you're yelling and you're homeschooling them and then you get up and you take the kids to practice for sports or scouts or whatever and then you do it all over again that stop making it as I'm just going to work or I'm just staying at home you're more than just a stay-at-home mom or dad you're more than just a working mom or dad your identity goes way beyond that and sometimes and often we lose who we are in the middle of that and we want to make sure that we don't lose that and we don't want our kids to lose that so modeling that for them and teaching them how to not be bored and to seize opportunities to find new hobbies and new ways of interacting. So I wanted to drop that a bit of information and insight because I've been hearing that a lot this week with a lot of the patients I've been seeing and seeing that it can be a, it really deflates you because it makes you feel like you've lost your purpose. So again, reframe that and find this time of maybe quiet to re- um, evaluate your goals and reevaluate your hobbies and interests and start doing something you've been putting off or that you haven't done in a while. Thanks so much for watching and I wish you, wish you the very best. Thanks.